Morning beekeepers, people that are watching this. Good afternoon, good day, good evening, whatever time of day it is. Um, obviously at the yard, as you can tell by the get up. Um, first off, apologies for the lack of videos. Um, given everything that's going on at the moment, um, by that I'm referring to the COVID-19. We, um, me and my wife are both working from home and my kids uh, are in a nursery. Now normally when I was coming down and doing inspections and filming it and such like my kids would be at nursery and I wouldn't have to rush but unfortunately with both my kids at home and my wife starting work in an hour or so um, I just don't have the time to, to get the kit up and do all in-depth videos so I'm really sorry about that one this year's I'm hoping isn't going to be a complete bust on that front but it's, it's looking more and more likely so I'm really sorry thank you to the subscribers that have stuck with me I know I've lost a few I'm not surprised my videos have been a bit rubbish recently but I'm hoping that we can get these up and running again so um, that out of the way uh, what we've done so this is my first video I think of this year properly um, we have got obviously Hive 1 Hive 2 running very well uh, Hive 2 was a little bit ahead of the game last week she was putting up um, swarm cells um, I have um, Fortunately, there's still eggs and stuff like that in there, so they haven't gone, they haven't, they haven't left. I've still got a, uh, I've still got signs of a laying queen in there. Uh, but what I have done today is I've split hive two. I'll go into that in a minute. Hive one, running really well. She's our reliable one. Um, slowly but surely building up her stores again, looking really happy. I have put a queen excluder and a super on. Unfortunately, my queen excluder, I think, is too small um, because I've watched it for about 20 minutes or so and just only one or two bees was able to struggle to get through so I'm gonna come down next uh, soon and uh, replace that um, with the second one just so I can get them up in the super uh, on uh, on Hive 1. Hive 2 already has got a super on there drawing that out and filling that nicely uh, as I've said she's been split today uh, and I'll run you over to Hive 3 in just a moment. Uh, while I'm here let's go and have a quick look at the bees. Who's the gloves? So this is Hive 1 you can see, doing really well, happy days. Lots of bees coming and going, she's looking grand. So that's hive one, she's our faithful hive. Uh, hive two, a bit manic at the moment, so bear with. So this is hive two, lots of pollen coming in, lots of nectar coming in. Obviously I've just taken half their halves away, so they're a bit pissed off with me, but they're, uh, they're not too bad. So that's hive two, as you can see, doing really well. Um, I'm hoping with the fact that I've split them, I've reduced any chances of swarming, uh, excuse me, uh, down to a down to a minimum. So, and then we come down to hive three. So hive three is this one down here. Uh, now there is eggs, larvae, uh, young bees, old bees, all sorts of bees in that hive. So um, I'm hoping that what's going to happen is they're probably going to produce their own queen. Um, I'm pretty confident hive two has still got the original queen. Um, I know I should have brought them back the other way, but it didn't happen that way. Um, few guards coming out seeing what I'm up to lovely job so that's hive three uh, this is hive four which is gonna be our nuke um, that one oh, excuse me. sorry stop the video apologies so that's um that's our nuke um, which will probably be used to um, do another split uh, hive four was is at, at the uh, at the home being cleaned up at the moment so that's where we're at at the moment, uh, three hives, two with supers, one with a super being filled, one with a super not being filled because of the queen excluder. The likelihood is, is next week I'm going to come down again, assess hive one, see whether or not she needs to be split and check on the progress of hive three um, uh, and, and obviously again hive two as well. So I'll come down to a hive inspection all three hives. Whether or not we need to do another split, it's yet to tell. but. Um, We'll have that time all time. Uh, hive three, you'd notice it's got an entrance reducer on. Um, that is a very new hive, very young bees in that hive. Um, quite a lot, what a big territory for them to defend. So I popped a um, uh, reducer on there just so they've got a better chance of keeping that clean. Plus there's food in there as well, so they're going to go up and start feeding so they can draw out some of the new frames we've put in there. Uh, if you haven't seen a split done by me in the past, then if you have a look on one of my previous videos, there is a um, Hello girls. There is a, a video of uh, one of the brand new to beekeepers, which is uh, first attempt at split. I've done exactly the same as I have on that video as I have today. Um, taken some stores, taken some pollen, taken some honey, taken some young bees, old bees, yada yada yada, and put them into a new hive. Basically, it's it, it, it could be classed as a walkaway split. 
walk, put them in, walk away, let them do what they need to do. Should hopefully reduce the chances of them swarming. Uh, but I think that's about it at the moment. So that's uh, that's where the honey yard is working up at the moment. Again, thank you so much for keeping with me throughout these time, strange times. Uh, I will. I want to get some decent videos up. I really do. Uh, it's just obviously been difficult for for everybody uh, at the moment, which I, I hope you understand. Uh, if these bees are in my garden, it would probably be a different story. But they're not. They're in a, a separate yard, which I've got. To, I've got to drive to. Um, so you, you have to bear with me with um, camera equipment and stuff like that. So I'm going to leave them alone. Uh, thanks for joining again. Fingers crossed next week I'll have something better for you. But just to keep you up to date, this is where we are. We're still beekeeping. We're still going through the bees. Uh, we currently have three hives running, two successfully, one new. Uh, and like I said, we've got supers on two of them, one being filled, one not. Uh, so yeah, so I'll leave it there. Thanks very much indeed. I hope you're having a great time. I hope everyone with you and your family are well. And um, all the best to you. All right, cheers then. Bye-bye.